Four million from Tommy T. Fuck off. Uh, that's a lot of money, man. But. The straw that broke the camel's back. Uh, not good. One of my most active. Sir? Uh, not good. One of my most active and dependable judges just got wamboozled into doing something that could get him fired. Oh, wamboozled. Come on, wamboozled. That's pussy. <laughs> that's, that's the standard for getting fired? We should become a cop. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, honestly, hot take, hot take on uh, Wrangler and Penta and everything. Penta is a good role player. The character uh, scaring everyone, making sure criminals are scared, that's all, all good. Everything is good. But until he pushed beyond the boundaries, went outside the rules, and basically admins told him to stop, but he didn't, and he continued and kept doing some stuff behind the scenes with the warrants and shit and uh, ruining the judges' lives. Uh, that's why he got banned, not because of his role play, because I think he's a great role player, honestly. Like, the fact that he has such a presence on the server and everyone knows him and it's scary, right? Uh, it's scary doing any crime because you're afraid of Wrangler. I think that's, an ama that's amazing, honestly. So, I don't know. From my context that I saw, Right, from what I saw uh, on tw uh, on Twitter and shit, and like uh, from clips, I I feel like he got banned. He deserved the ban because he ignored, you know, admins like straight up warnings and shit, and he just went beyond it and kept doing the same shit and making their lives worse basically because they have they, they he basically broke the mechanics basically abused the mechanics. But as a role player, I think like he he can do a lot of shit anyways, even without being a cop. And I hope maybe he comes back as a cop one day. But that's just my take. Could be more context that I don't know, but yeah. A lot of people would say, oh, I had such great RP interactions with you. This, uh, this is the end of no pixel. It's not deserved, whatever. I disagree, honestly. I think it's deserved. If he was nice with you, that's fine. If he created a lot of good RP, that's fine. But he still broke the rules, you know? Multiple, multiple times when he got warned directly. So that's how I see it, basically. I mean, I... I don't know what you want me to say here. You, we've had literally hours of conversations about the key holder issue. You knew where, where we stood he? on it. You knew exactly oh, what the standards were, what we would sign for, what we wouldn't. So in good faith, a judge on his fucking birthday <laughs> reviews something. On his birthday. In good faith that you're acting <laughs> according to the hours of conversations we've had about this. And then finds out not only is he wrong, but now you want to go even further because of his misaction. Um, well, I'm gonna have to talk. Well, to Charlotte what? About, I'm gonna have to talk to Charlotte about this. <laughs> he had no comeback. So I'm with the cadet. That. Yeah, we're uh, you know, cadets make mistakes all the time. Uh, <laughs> right. And, uh, you know, we're just we're gonna have to talk to. Yeah, I I like the character. I mean, uh, they should get punished. I think if they do pit 140 miles per hour, I don't, I don't see it that often that they do that shit. Uh, 